Hi, I'm Mr. O Mingyo. Okay, I'm going to discuss two kinds of graphs that are found in the wave chapter. Okay, the first one is displacement distance graph, and the second one is displacement time graph. Okay, as we can see, the two shapes look the same. Okay, so how do we differentiate between these two graphs? Okay, we look at the x-axis. The x-axis for the displacement distance graph is in terms of distance. Okay, and the x-axis for displacement time graph is in terms of time. Okay, this is how we differentiate them. And before we attempt any questions uh, regarding this kind of graph, right, it's very important to look at the x-axis because um, it's going to give us different information. Okay, now uh, let's move on. Okay, what can we find from a displacement distance time graph? Basically, the y-axis, okay, from the, from the equilibrium point to the top, Okay, this is going to give us the amplitude, and the amplitude is equal to 5 cm in this case. Okay, and the second information that we can find, right, is actually the uh, distance of one wave, which is also the wavelength, okay, indicated by this distance. Okay, so wavelength is equal to 2 cm in this case. Okay, let me summarize. Uh. So for a displacement distance graph, we can find the amplitude as well as the wavelength. Okay, how about a displacement time graph? From the y-axis, same thing, we can find what is the amplitude, which is 5 cm. And the x-axis represents the time, so if we trace out one waveform, right, this will be the time taken for one wave, and this is what we call our period. So period is equal to 4 seconds. And with period, right, we can find the frequency. Frequency is equal to 1 over period. And this will give us 1 over 4, which is 0 0.25 hertz. Okay, um, usually after we analyze these two graphs, uh, the question will ask us for the speed. And as we know for this chapter, right, the speed of a wave is equal to F lambda. Okay, so my frequency we found that is 0 0.25 times the wavelength which is 2 cm. So we will get the answer as 0 0.5 cm per second. And this will be the speed of the wave. 